are new here, my name is Lisa and this is my stained glass journey. I am so glad that you are here with me today. Today I am going to pop into my local Dollar Tree. I'm going to be building some shields for my students just to kind of keep them safe. They don't have to use them if they don't want to, but I feel better making them and having them available to them. So I'm going to show you how to do this. Let's go. All right, I am out of the store, so here's actually what I bought. I bought three of these project display boards. They were a dollar. If this works out, I am not going to be buying like three of these per student. I have 14 in my classroom right now, maybe possibly more. I, if this works out and I like how this looks, I'm probably just going to talk to an old boss of mine that will get, probably give me some cardboard from like when they unload their truck. I might ask her, but this, it'll be about the same thickness as this display board. So I bought three of these and my plan is to cut off the panel and make almost like a frame. So cut out most of the center and use a clear, I'm going to try a shower curtain for the original, but I'll probably end up getting some painter's plastic that's transparent so that you can see through it and then attaching them with velcro so a piece of velcro in one corner a piece of velcro in the other corner and then a piece to connect the two together i know i might not be making much sense right now i honestly have the plan in my head i will definitely show you once i get it worked out and then i need to start kind of doing things for the school year so i bought these cute little cards they're little puppies for my students, I'm just going to write them a note like, hey, I hope you're having a wonderful summer. I'm your homeroom teacher. I can't wait to see you soon. The only thing that I really need is the clear plastic. I'm going to check Dollar General to see if they have a clear shower liner, and I will check back in with you. All right, so this is kind of a fun angle, so I'm just going to kind of talk real quick. Shower curtain for the areas for the students to look through. The most expensive item by far matched everything else and then some. Boards were th $1 a piece, $3 total. The Velcro was a dollar, so that's four. This shower curtain, four fifty. dollars Now, in the grand scheme of things, I am up to eight fifty dollars to make a make a shield i the only other thing that i would need really to is the stuff to make it pretty like you know i'm getting some kind of patterned duct tape or something to make them pretty give them something that if they use it great if they don't great i want to make sure that as the teacher i am doing everything in my power to make sure they're safe so can't wait to show you how to put these things together
making my mock-up. I am ready to take this to my school to put it on some desks to test it out for the dimensions. I have the feeling it's a little too long. The sides are a little too long, so I will definitely be checking that out and modifying it. I will keep you guys posted on what I find out. Thank you so much for watching till the end of this video and for supporting me and my YouTube channel. Please don't hesitate to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and also to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you're made aware every time I post a new video and we will see you in the next one.